Uh, Spielberg today, and I'm looking at the quote on the site, Collider, uh, mentioned that he's comparing the superhero genre to being a Western, the Western genre. Okay. How it went for a very long time, that mm -hmm. everyone was making Westerns, and then it sort of faded away, and every once in a while they come back. What's your thoughts, honestly, on the superhero movie genre? Do you see his, his sort of, because I could see his take on this, where he, the, because everyone's making superhero movies, sure. but what, what's your take on the genre as a whole? Do you think it has what it takes to for the long haul, or do you think we're looking at a, a, a moment in time? Well, I, I certainly think given the fact that technology is finally advanced, they're, they're always going to be looking for other films to match their technological accomplishments. You know what I mean? Any film that can incorporate these larger-than-life characters and fantastical locations and plots, the, the, the technology wants to prove that they can do it. So whether it's superhero films or just fantasy in general, that's going to be a... That, that, that's going to surge for a while. And in terms of superhero in general, like existing... Uh, you know properties that we know and love. It's it's going to be a matter of the tone they strike. You know what I mean? Like you could look at Jason Bourne as a superhero. I think you could take any superhero movie, and if you ground it enough, if you make it real enough, uh, it, it doesn't have to. That's what I think the Russos do really well. I mean, certain superhero movies feel like superhero movies. Russo movies almost feel like human stories with a little bit of superhero sprinkle. You know what I mean? Like sure. so. So I think. Um, you know, you, you, you might get exhausted of the larger-than-life powers, I suppose. Um, but, but, you know, I, as long as the filmmakers keep on reinventing the approach and the flavor and the tone, um, I, the audiences are going to still go.